If you have a real estate trust and you have your house in that trust, you avoid a process called probate. What is probate? Let me give you an example. Let's say Mr. Smith owns a house. He has a will in place. That's a good start. If Mr. Smith passes away and I go out to meet with the family and I say, okay, who gets to sign on behalf of Mr. Smith? If Mr. Smith's son, Joey, says, well, I get a sign because he left the house to me. And I'm going to ask, well, was the house in a trust? No, it wasn't. Then even though there was a will in place, the house would still have to go through probate because even though there was that will, Joey's going to have to be named as that personal representative of the estate of Mr. Smith simply because there wasn't a trust. So a lot of folks will say, I'm not going to worry about a trust. I've already got a will. That's a great start, but it doesn't avoid probate. 